Thank you for watching my video. I have a review here. I'm going for another nozzle. So I have this electric blower. In this case, it's a Milwaukee. Could be a DeWalt or any other ones. It doesn't really matter what brand it is. But the new electric ones all are round. And there's really nothing wrong with that. It works pretty good. You know, it's just that I had a gasoline Husqvarna one two five B and it had a nozzle on it that I really liked uh, especially works with some leaves that get stuck that I want to dislodge so this one I bought from tech swap on Etsy for basically eighteen dollars I think I paid a dollar or two less it's seventeen now anyway I bought it from him and good reviews I might even left a good review however see all this tape I put on here it's because it broke see how it broke it's 1 16th of an inch thick there's a little lip right here to help it grab on to the end here and there's a little lip on here it's to the outside and it broke here too so what I do is I kind of sweep along the ground and I don't know whether I hit it against something or whatever but I mean that was in February <laughs> I bought it on February 21st and here it is the end of September and it's no good it's already you know DIY hack taped up to keep it from falling apart even more so anyway I bought one on eBay the eBay one was hot Scott print shop lick okay anyway I just got it so there's no review on it I paid fifteen twenty-five. You know, there's tax involved with that. I think it was free shipping, so I don't remember paying shipping. So uh, it took nine days from ordering to delivery. So he doesn't have a stockpile. He must print it up uh, as soon as he gets the order. So it came very well wrapped. I measured it with my calipers and it is twice as thick now it's a little more focused also which actually I like you know see how wide this is in here that's more like their traditional uh, Husqvarna type leaf blower very wide across here this one is very narrow in height and and short in width I mean, it just fits in there completely uh, and if I didn't say it already it's twice as thick there's also a little bit of lip on both sides so I had to get my calipers in there in such a way almost had to go to the micrometers but my calipers fit on there see there's a gap in there so there's a way to uh, measure it so that the edge is in the gap and it doesn't influence the uh, measurement I also had some micrometers but I didn't need to mic it so it's basically uh, twice as thick it's much heavier I should probably weigh them all right I measured them up and the first one that I purchased off uh, Etsy uh, came in at uh, 0.12 pounds or 0 0.05 kilograms and this one's basically twice as much because it's twice as thick came in at uh, 0.22 pounds or 0 0.10 kilograms so that kind of explains it so this one uh, from Etsy TechSwap uh, is definitely a fail sorry about that TechSwap need to thicken it up uh, you need to double down on this one I'm afraid uh, this one I don't have a history on it yet see that it fits very tight snug it is not going to blow off of there all right
right, and we're going to give that a show. And if it fails, which I'm not going to say I doubt it because who knows nowadays. Uh, it's a really hard plastic. I don't do 3D printing, so I don't know the different types of plastic that's available to melt into a unit. Uh, they both did many layers. I'm sure it took hours to run the program. But anyway, here's my review. One bad, one hopefully better but unknown. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to stick this in before I conclude because uh, I figured out why I like the uh, nozzle end instead of the round end. And that is to get up in the garage and get the cobwebs out. And sometimes... <laughs> Whoops. Sometimes on the uh, front porch too. So this really gets the concentration going. And first use, the eBay one. Uh, work great. The one that's twice as thick as the other one. I'm happy with it. It's actually a little smaller. It's more concentrated. The other one flared out, which was okay, but it reduced the range. So I guess that's why Milwaukee and DeWalt and all those other ones uh, keep it round, is to get the concentration going uh, so you have a small impact area and a strong gust area to uh, uh, work with. 